It's Huddy and the Chili King back for another food review. And we're doing a gay little breakfast this morning. Uh, what? I was going to say from. Oh, tell them where from. Dunkin' Donuts. So we went to Dunkin' Donuts and we got donut fries. Uh, th these have got to be good. If they're not good, I'll be really surprised. But uh, we just got out of church and it is coming a flood in North Alabama this morning. Is it not? It is. It's coming a flood. And we're about to try these uh, Dunkin' Donuts donut fries just for you, the viewer. All right, honey, you ready? Let's get let's get on with it. Let's don't make this video long. We already it's... made a thirty minute video. <laughs> so. We've already subjected these people to a long video, and then a video with us having their hair up in goofy ponytails. So this is our first official new video after our one year anniversary. Yes. Yes. <laughs> All right, so let's try them. Okay, so it's basically just a donut. Strip. What's on that? Cinnamon, maybe? Cinnamon sugar. That's good. I don't know what these cost. I'd probably rather just have donuts, but these are still good. There's nothing to say. Not, not much to say about them. Mm -mm. You know what I wish we had to dip them in? Chocolate. Chocolate icing. Think about that, don Dunkin' Donuts. Give, them, give us a side of chocolate icing to dunk them in. To These are good. I love Dunkin' Donuts donuts. To dunk, Dunkin' dunk them in. Lightning has been detected one mile from our house. Oh, gosh. I'm telling you. It's rained probably an inch or more this morning. These, yeah, they definitely have cinnamon and sugar. I mean, it's just... It's like a big steak fry. These are good. Would I run out and get them? No. I would, no. Not, I would rather get their breakfast sandwiches or their donuts. I would too. I would rank this pretty low on the must-haves from Dunkin'. Mm -hmm. I would rank... Their breakfast sandwiches are really good. I would also rather have quite a few of their donuts, which we have right over there. So, let's go ahead and score these, Huddy Buddy. It's going to be a short video. <laughs> it is. So, what would you give Dunkin' Donuts donut fries on a zero to five scale, with a zero being you, the McRib, which, by the way, he said that his least favorite thing was that pickle slush, but we went back and somebody commented and we went back and looked. He hated the McRib to the point where he took like two bites of it and threw it in the trash. <laughs> and he had forgotten about that. But anyway, so zero being the McRib in Hudson's eyes and five being the crystal, the, what was it called? The pimento cheese crystal. What would you give these donut fries? A 3.5. They're good, but they're not amazing. It's good. I agree. They're fine. I just would rather have pretty much anything else from that. Not anything, but most everything else they have. I'm gonna, I'm gonna give them a 3.5 as well. And as I give them a 3.5, I've eaten every single one of them. See, and I will say this about Duncan. For those of y'all that eat at Duncan, you probably already know this, but their coffee is outstanding. And a small coffee, it's like $1.69. I would go there 100 times out of 100 times over Starbucks. It's just where I am in my life. All right, so we spent all day on the river yesterday. We went to Yellowhammer Brewing Company on Friday night in Huntsville. We've had no downtime this weekend. So today, we're about to go watch Croatia play France. We just heard on the radio that it's two to one France almost at halftime. So go Croatia. Yeah, Atlanta. go Croatia. We are from Croatia initially. <laughs> no, we're not. <laughs> Most of Alabama is from Croatia. Mm -hmm. All right, so thanks for watching. We're up over 660 subscribers. Yay! We need to get to 1,000 because we got to get his mother in the video. But for now, we're going to go watch soccer. So for Huddy, Chili King, we're out. Toodles.